All right, I wanna do a quick video on something you might be running into if you are trying to clean a carb yourself for like your lawnmower, is you might be putting it together and realize that the float does not go level. It should be like that. It should be straight up and down, but when you put it together, it doesn't do that. What's the cause? Well, let's take this out. It actually has to do with the sealing surface of this needle here. So this float obviously moves up and down. To use this needle to close an opening where the fuel goes in. So the fuel goes in here, it comes out there, and that, that red seat is actually the sealing surface for this needle to go into, and that's what actually stops the fuel. What happens is this sits in ethanol-based fuel and actually will swell up over time. It is something that can be replaced, and in fact, they sell, you know, you'll get a, a big quantity <laughs> of, uh, of seats. It's like a little seal for, uh, for the, the needle. And all you have to do is just pull it out and stick a new one in. So let's do that real fast. Let's find a drill bit that's gonna go in this hole. All right, here's a 5 64ths. Let's see if this works. Okay, so I got it in the hole. And I'm just gonna kinda try to pry it up here. And you can see sometimes they get pretty stuck. And there she is. So there's the old one. So here is a new one. You can see the hole's quite a bit bigger and on the back, it's actually open. So here's the old one. This is the old one. You can see it has junk in it. This is the new one. You can see it's actually open. This, the open side will go up into the carburetor. The flat side will be pointing down and this is the side that the needle goes into. What I am going to do is kind of drop this into place. Oh, kind of fell funky on me. We we'll wanna make sure that this is sitting up right here. So again, open side is going to go down. Just flip it on me. There we go. So as you can see, starting to get it going in the right direction here. So we'll kind of get it seated. And then what we're going to do is get a drill bit fits right in this hole. Okay, so this is a 13 64ths. Okay, do like a final little see how she looks. Looks pretty good. All right. Let's put this needle back into the float here. Okay, let's see where she sits now. So as you can see, I want to say perfect, but it's definitely better. So it's a little bit more natural. If you push it down, you can see it kind of sits in there. Obviously, that needle will kind of expand that hole just a little bit over time to where it'll probably sit just fine, but that is an indicator when this isn't sitting right, that that seat has swollen. What that means is that the hole is going to be too small to allow the proper amount of gas into the carburetor. And then obviously with this float going up, it's gonna allow less fuel to fill the bowl, which then means you're gonna be running lean and either destroy the engine or run out of gas or both. But that is the fix, and hopefully that helps people out there with their uh, carburetor cleaning. All right, thank you guys.